another vlog so this is a cross-country training vlog um you can all the shavings in the back um so tomorrow me and abby are going cross-country training with chalky and willow um i'm so excited i actually took chalky in like my first month of having him last year and he was actually really good um he he had like a little habit of refusing um so we started off a bit sticky um but once like he got on his flow he loved it he was flying them all so I'm really interested to see how he compares this time versus how he was when I first got him. I've got my trusty dog clippers here because I'm just going to give him a little trim up. Um, he's got like a little beard going on. Um, so I'm going to sort that out, give him a groom, make sure he's all nice. And I'm going to take my tack home tonight and clean it. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. Let's go see Chucky. Hello. So we just went on a little ride and I've trimmed his little beard as you can tell, he had a few wispy bits so I obviously leave his whiskers, but I trimmed your little beard, oh, oh. good boy, now I'm just going to give him a groom, it's not too bad, but good boy, smarten you up a bit, ready for tomorrow, yeah? Ash has very kindly let me try this on Shopee because I really want it. So let's see what the mink looks like. Give me a little mink boy. I'm not sure. This is the mink hair collar. I do like it, but I just feel like he's a bit too orange for it. I'm not sure. Hmm. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments. Good boy. What do you think? Do you like it? Little Hello. sneak peek of our favourite duo. We're off on our second pack. You look so good in the mink. Thank you very much. Have fun. Chucky's okay. enjoying his dinner. We're going to eat up and get some energy for tomorrow. How was he? He was such a good boy. He was a good boy, though. He right? was a little plod along, which Aww. is what we like. We ended up going out with Sam. Oh. Which is really weird because I'm used to being on Sam. Yeah, um, seeing it from another perspective. But you know what? He was so good. I wondered how he'd be with another horse. Yeah. And he just uh, plodded along. Oh, he's, he's such, such a, good a good boy. boy. I'm very proud of you. Bless him. He's settling so nice. He good job, Ash. <laughs> boy, what have you got in your forelock? Oh, are you smiling? Let me get that out for you. There you go. You're going to get a good night's sleep tonight, yeah? Yeah? Good boy. Oh. Pardon you, what was that? We've got cross country in the morning, so sleep well. Got all your tack here, ready to clean. You're a good boy. I love you. Mm. Oh, thank you for that lovely kiss. Monkey boy, though, you don't buy too much, boy. Mm. It's a cross country tomorrow, do you remember it? Yeah, do you remember? You're gonna be a good boy. Yeah? You will, won't you? You'll be a good boy. See? Say good night to the vlog. Hey guys, so it is like eight o'clock um, and I've just absolutely demolished a KFC. Fraser's not here tonight, so I just have like some takeaway and now I'm gonna sit and clean my tack. I just use the um, Prestige Balsam. Um, because my saddle's prestige, so I just thought I'd get that one as well. I'm so excited for tomorrow. I'm a bit nervous, but I'm mainly excited. Let me show you guys the setup. I've got all my tack here, my boots. I can't forget my boots, my girth. Um, ready to be cleaned. I'm just watching a film. So yeah, a nice quiet evening getting ready for tomorrow. Um, so I'll probably catch you guys in the morning. Good morning everyone, it is the morning of cross country, I'm so excited, just got dressed and got ready, I'm wearing um, all black, I'm wearing um, the Aztec diamond tights and 
the Aztec diamond top. I'm so excited. I'm a bit nervous, um, but like I always get nervous before cross country anyway. Um, so it's gonna be a good day though. The weather's really nice. I'm just a bit concerned that um, the ground might be quite hard because um, there hasn't really been any rain for the last at least week. So like I know around our tracks, um, the ground is rock hard. So I don't know if they maybe like water the crawls or if they have like surface before and after each fence. Um, so that's just something I'm gonna be mindful of today on his legs. And then I've got to go pick up Fraser because he's cameraman today, even though he went out last night. So <laughs> the, the footage might be a bit shaky. I'll catch up with you guys when I go get Chucky. Oh my gosh, what a morning. So I've been and picked Fraser up from London. It's quarter nine. I've been into London. I driven home, put Fraser to bed for a few hours. Um, now I just went to get, so it's Abby's birthday tomorrow. I just went to get her a birthday cake and then realized that Sainsbury's is closed because it is quarter to nine on a Sunday. So the only thing open was M&S uh, fuel garage. And of course they want 400 pounds for birthday cake. So we've gone with like, these like bite-sized things. So Abby, I hope you like them. Are you excited for cross country? Yeah? No. <laughs> he says I'm excited to go in that field, so put me out right now. Well, unfortunately, you're not going out today, Chucky, so... I had to get you all spruced up. Yeah? In the tree. Happy, <laughs> Happy birthday! Happy birthday! I'm so excited about the food. I gave her. I fought very hard to get those this morning, Abby. No, don't get excited. Don't get it's excited. not that. <laughs> it's, it's not what you think oh it my is. god, I can't. Why? I like to wrap so you can't open it. <laughs> <laughs> what in the fuck is this? What is this? Is this the Oh, it's not the Oreo cookie. 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 Oh, it's did your mum tell you? My mum went, well, Abby, I couldn't get the size. <laughs> and I was like, wait until I see her. Did you expect us to get it? No. Uh, no. We're a proper plane up. Uh, I thought like. we love you, Joanne. We love you, Joanne. Thank you she for covering that. for Anna. us. Anna. 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 Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So your set is complete for today. So there is a little something else in there for you. Ooh, this one is called wrapping. I love wrapping. Come on, skip. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see me because of the sun, uh, but I just did all my yard jobs. Chucky had a little turnout in the school and went absolutely mental. Half the yard is going to be empty because the other guys are going on a sponsored ride as well. So we're all very excited. We've all got lots going on. Starting to load up our tack now. Got my tackle in here, got my saddle, got my girth here, bridle martingale. I'm just going to go get his boots and stuff. I'm just doing him. A little hay net for the pot. Yeah, I'm gonna make a small hay net, make sure all my tack and stuff is packed, and then start cleaning him. Good boy, time to get this lucky boy clean. Got a whole gang out today. Gonna put his hay net up and stuff. We've got all our tack in here. I've got saddle pad, my saddle, my girth. Is my girth there? Yeah. Bridle, body protector, hat. Got my boots, I need to put those on now. Got his brushing boots down there. Looks good, I think. I've got this brush with me in case I need it. Um, I think we're good to go. Oh, where am I going? Oh, are they in my pocket? Yeah. Tie 
hide himself. <laughs> Really chill because it's on our own time. Like yeah, time is my biggest thing. This is nice and chill. You look so a nice and handsome, Chucky. Yes, you are. Color. Like, he's gonna walk straight on. Yes, he is, because he is a good boy. Mm -hmm. Just arrived. He's travelled so nicely. You're getting used to it, aren't you? Good boy. I'm just gonna get tacked up and then we'll be off. Arab mode has come out. You've been so good, aren't you? He's actually been quieter than he is at home. <laughs> I don't know if you can see me because the sun's on my screen, but hopefully Ash did a good job vlogging us. Hi everyone! <laughs> they were both so good, we're just grazing now and we're having something to eat. Uh, but yeah, they were such good horses, good start to the season, keeping it nice and steady. 
She was so good. Jumped, she was really good. She jumped so lovely. The uh, the cross country fence has backed her off a bit, so. Yeah, I actually had to kick, which. It's a foreign concept to you. <laughs> Feels so weird leaning back and kicking. But she had some really nice jumps. Yeah, she launched herself. In your new watermelon. Looks so good. But I was a bit sweaty though, so. You're so tired now, aren't you? Yeah, all of us are sleep on. <laughs> Chucky. So yeah, we're just gonna um, load the horses up, finish our little picnic. <gasps> oh my God, no! <laughs> no, it's the fun. Oh. oh my God. Well, on that note, guys, we'll probably catch you back no, at the yard. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this vlog i hope you've enjoyed it um i was just editing and i thought i'd run you guys through a little outro of how i felt the day went i did come home feeling a bit deflated um with young horses there's such a fine line between like pushing them out of their comfort zone to make the leap to that next level but also knowing when to stop. I felt I played it really safe with Chucky, um, which definitely isn't a bad thing. I guess I came home thinking a bit like, did I play it too safe? Um, he at the minute is very comfortable jumping, show jumping about 70, but he just doesn't really have the muscle yet um, to go higher comfortably. And cross country definitely isn't the place to kind of test that theory. Um, so I stuck to the 70 course yesterday which he was really good at and he jumped everything really nicely. And um, because he was jumping it so nicely, I wanted him to end on that good note. But I guess when I came home, I was like, maybe I should have asked a few more trickier questions. So I feel like with a young horse, it's quite easy to doubt yourself and what you're doing and if you're keeping up with everyone else or if you're going too slowly. But I'd much rather come home with a healthy, happy horse than have asked a bit too much of him and he either scared himself or hurt himself. It was kind of my feelings last night, but waking up today, I definitely feel a lot more better about it. It was only the first training of the year and there's gonna be plenty more opportunities when he's ready to go and push him a bit harder. Um, so yeah, he's a really good boy. I'm really happy with him. They, I lost quite a lot of footage because for some reason it's not working on my laptop. I wanted this vlog to be a bit longer, but it's just not worked out that way. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It really helps me out. And don't forget to subscribe to my Instagram. And there's lots of new photos going on there. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next vlog.